at another antique store here in Oklahoma City. It's called <laughs> The Rink. It's called Roller Skating in here. I believe it was once the Roller Rink. That's what Dutch says anyway. It was. Oh yeah, look at the floor. Yeah, we'll look at the round edge on the floor. Yeah. Okay. Cool place. And it's cool inside. It's hot outside. We probably won't buy anything because we have no room to put something to take it home. But it's fun to walk around and look at stuff. And who knows? We may find that famous lost piece of artwork like this. Look at that. That's pretty cool. It's a painting from 1968. He says I missed a painting. I don't know how I could have missed it. I haven't gotten that far yet. But. It's a sign, paint by number. <laughs> it looks like a paint by number. It is. Is it really? Yeah. From 1968. This one's kind of cool. Is that a real painting? That's scary. Yes. Oh, I found Erica. Actually, I think Erica found me. What do you think of this? I've been here before. I've done this. Oh, we did buy something here last time we were here. Nice. That is nice. It's too short for that. Ooh, no, it's full size, solid oak, full size, eighteen ninety seven. They only want one thousand two hundred seventy five dollars for it. That's just the frame. That's just the frame. You have to add your box spring and your mattress. That's pretty nice, though. Something else. I think that would be cool in our driveway. No passing zone. How much is a no passing zone sign? 36. 36. They have all kinds of signs, though. I don't sound like a Uber, even though I've lived most of my life in the UP. Eh? Eh? Erica sort of sounds like one. It comes out at times when she least expects it. Oh, she can go back and forth. She can have a Uber accent or no accent. My son went to Germany as a foreign exchange student and they were trying to guess where he was from because before he went to Germany he didn't know any German but he did know some Dutch. So when he started learning German he would speak German with a bit of a Dutch accent and they couldn't figure out where he was from. And mostly they would say, are you from Denmark? <laughs> and he'd say, no, I'm from the United States. And yeah, they were very confused by that. <laughs> what happens when you have a parent from one place, another parent from another location, and the children are raised in a third location. So we're in this antique store. See, Eric and I, it wasn't, but I really, really, really see it. Isn't that, isn't that pretty? It must be Mexican, so it's in Spanish at some time. Is it a name? Is it something? No. It's what I wanted. They go, I keep yachting. Look at this. You don't know what you'll find. It is a little cat. Creamer. Oh, she's right. I probably shouldn't have. You know, that's actually really cute. Oh, it's stuck in my fingers. $29. Oh. What do you think? They have bifocals and they actually work. <laughs> wow, they make everything look big. <laughs> Seriously, everything looks bigger than it is. I should get them. They're only five bucks, right? Do I need glasses? What do you think? She likes them so much, she wants to get a pair. What do you think? Oh, they fit you better. She said you look like your dad, but I think you look like my mom. There she is! Trying to get the red out. Okay, show me your pie. There it is. We are in another antique store in Oklahoma. We've been here before. Hi. <laughs> she says hi, nice and close up. I like this. Let's get this. 
Let's check the price. Oh, you know what? The trunk's full, and she's half naked. It's only a hundred and eighty-nine dollars. Is she? No, she not. That's the hat. And then, when we build a snowman this winter, we can put a top hat on it. This is kind of neat. They have it set up like an old library. Cool this is what I want to show you. Someday, if I were to open a store, I would want this counter. Look at this. They've got these things set on top. I don't know if they're part of it or not. But, see if I can get behind here. Look at this. This is so awesome, this display case. It goes on and on. And they've got seeds in the front. You could put anything. So I would put it in a candy store, an ice cream shop, or something like that. I just think it's so cool. Do we have a price for it? It's only $10,000. And they're calling it a seed cabinet. It's 16 feet long. Oh, it's labeled down there. The Shearer counter, so maybe it's from a store that's called Shearer. I don't know, it's pretty cool. I just think it is so neat. Yes, ma'am. Look at that, it's just full of drawers. Drawers and drawers and drawers. So you put your merchandise behind here, and the customer comes up and says, I'd like a pound of something kidney beans. And you open the drawer. For the kidney beans, what were, what was on the other side? Let's see, and I bet they're turning groove. No, they're just nailed. Ooh, that's a little surprising. I gotta close that. So don't come and buy it because I want to get it someday when I open a store. See, don't I look great standing in front of this? This cabinet, I would look great in a store with this cabinet. They only want 10000 for it. What do you think? It'll fit in our trunk? Oh, you could make one. Oh, there's one on a stand, too. Yeah. So if you wanted to open a coffee shop, want something special in there, Dutch wants to open a coffee shop. Or just an old store. How much is that one? It's on sale today. $400 off. Off of what? <laughs> that's, that's a good point. Yep. Well, this one without the stand is 1600 Check it out. I found something else for their coffee shop. You Look at that. Like I don't even like coffee, but isn't that cool? So we're in this antique store. We're in this antique store, and I saw this phone. See this phone? Look at that phone. It's a rotary phone with a rotary dial. Hello. Hello. Oh, look, he's on the phone back there. Hello. I have the monitor. Oh, that's better because when I was a kid, we had a rotary phone on our wall. Yeah, I'm old. And, um,. I used to have nightmares that I'd be calling for help, especially when 911 first came out. And I always said, why did they pick 9? That's the furthest one. And you have to dial all the way around. It should have been like 111 one, instead of 9. One, one. See, that takes forever. But I used to have nightmares that I trying to make an emergency call and if you made if you made a mistake you'd have to start over. Oh I didn't go all the way I have to start over. That's my nightmare. My story was a phone. I don't know. I found a license plate. Look what it says. It's probably backwards. Oma. That's what my grandkids call me. Oma. Okay, I'm back. Here's what I'm doing. I'm eating some of my my cake. This cake is the cake I made before our trip. I actually did a video of it, but we have a Senegal parrot and it was really loud in the background. I didn't realize it when I was recording, 
But that bird, because the house was quiet except for the dogs and the bird, early in the morning we got back from our DC trip and so I made this cake so that I'd have it to bring along on this trip. And I recorded it. But the bird is so loud, I can't share it with you. Maybe just a clip. It's done. I pulled it out of the oven. I may have left it in just a little bit too long, but the last time it was still gooey in the middle, I ate it and it was great. But I'm still sitting here in the car. A storm is rolling in. The radar showed red, 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 red. It rained overnight. There was lightning and thunder. The clouds are moving really fast. I don't know if you can see. That's, that's the good side. The dark clouds are behind me and I can't give you a good picture of that. So you just have to take my word for it. Still waiting on Dutch and Erica. Ha, ah, we're at the Sooner Mall. <laughs> I'm not a mall shopper. I never was, even back in the 80s when it was a big thing. Okay, I'll be honest. I used to go to the mall and go shopping with my sisters. But why? Because that was the place to get the stuff you needed. <laughs> I saw you. It's such a beautiful day. Oh, he put flowers in my hair. Oh, check this out. This is so cute. It's so ugly. It's cute. I had to turn it around. We are in Goodwill and the storm is hit. Check it out. You can hear it. Let's see it. Now we gotta go out in that. We got wet coming up to the car. Not Dutch, he came out before us. He came out and dealt with us. we all knew it was coming. Yeah, the flag is flying straight out. Can you see that? And I reached into the tub and found a spider. I'll show you the video I made. 